Our goal here is to use a data set, take a look at it on a scatter plot, look for correlation, and see if a best fit line fits the data. We're going to use data for this with distances of planets and uh, plutoid from the sun, and also take a look at the max temperature in degrees Fahrenheit, the distance we're measuring in millions of miles. So we're setting up our data chart here. And as we go, we're taking a look back at our sources to make sure that we're recording this data accurately. Now we're setting up the scatter plot, labeling the axes. On the y-axis, we'll have the max surface temperature in degrees Fahrenheit, and on the x-axis, distance from the sun in millions of miles. We need to take a look at our scale to make sure that we can fit this data on the graph. So we're using the range of the data and a calculator to determine what the scale will be on the y-axis and then what the scale will be on the x-axis. On this particular graph, we ended up using 100 degrees Fahrenheit for every mark on the y-axis and 150 million miles away from the sun for every mark on the x-axis. Now we're going to start plotting our planets and plutoids as we go here, starting with Mercury, how far it is from the sun and the max surface temperature, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. And we check as we go. Just darkening the marks. Now taking a look at correlation. There's definitely some kind of negative trend across the graph, but it's not clustered together. It's not linear. Taking a look now, does the best fit line fit this? Is there a line that does this? No. A curve, as I'm tracing here, best fits this data.